Sophomores episode nine. This is a great episode. In fact, this is the best of the season so far. I really love this episode. So in this episode, um, you see, uh, after the events of the last episode, Vice Admiral well, What's-His-Face is captured by the Jedi. And Ahsoka and Master Luminara are now on a mission to make sure he gets back to the Republic and, and is imprisoned for his war crimes. And meanwhile, Asaz, Asaz Ventress, which is an original character created for the series, is, is basically trying to get into the ship and get him back to prove herself to Count Dooku. Which, this is a great episode because you see a lot of uh, Master Luminara, who is, I can't remember if she's the original character in this series or not. It doesn't matter. You see a lot of her here, and it's she's a great character overall. I think she's really interesting. You don't really know too much about her, but you kind of see a little bit of her har- arrogance in this episode and kind of see her fail a little bit, which is interesting. Uh, she learns from Ahsoka, which is Ahsoka also gets a lot of characterization in this episode because she's got this amazing dynamic with um, with Master Luminara, and her using kind of the dark side. You see with uh, Vice Admiral, well, what's his face? And by the way, I'm calling him that because I don't actually know his name, and I'm not going. I don't really care to learn it. And so, yeah. And I, you know, so he's in this episode, uh, and she's trying to get information out of him. Well, she like threatens him to murder him with the lightsaber. She wasn't planning to, but she's using more violent tactics that the Jedi's don't usually use, which is interesting. And it's fascinating. And you kind of see this dynamic where she's, Anakin is rubbing off on her. She's learning things from Anakin that maybe not necessarily are good. And maybe, um, by the way, Anakin is not in this episode, but also, she's also learning things from Luminara, who is a brilliant Jedi master, and it's just this whole interesting dynamic. Also, you see parallels from her and Asaz Ventress, both apprentices trying to prove themselves, and both raised on opposite sides, and just... There's a bunch of parallels and similarities, and this and this really it looks like it could lead to something very, very interesting later in the series, and I'm super excited to get through the rest of the series and see that, because this character is fantastic, and I love the series, and I'm super excited to see more of the show um, after this episode, because with a lot of these episodes, I thought they have okay. The first three, I, I liked them. They were good. The rest of them were kind of just slow burners. And I just really haven't gotten into Clone Wars because a lot of this season is very slow. And, you know, this is a good episode, though, that made me excited maybe not to watch the rest of the season, but at least finish this season and get to some of the uh, later seasons that get better better as the show goes on because this is a really good season. And I love this season. I mean, this is still a good season uh, overall. It's just got its own little flaws, and it's got some episodes that I don't care for, that I don't think are even good. I think there's just good things here, though, and I think if you're a fan of, like, Star Wars at all, you should have watched this show by now. I'm not dissing anybody who hasn't, because I have not seen this entire series. I've not even seen all of Rebels. I haven't seen all of Resistance, so I don't watch everything Star Wars, okay? I don't. But I'm planning to make my way through that stuff. And I actually do want to talk about some of this stuff. And I did quit Resistance. And I don't know if I'll ever get back to watching it. Because honestly, I don't really want to ever. I don't want to suffer to write reviews. But overall, I did like this episode. And I think you should check this one out. And... The man, I I can't believe a lot of the fight the fights in this episode, the cinematography, the different motions and movements these characters have. It's fantastic, and this has some of the best animation of the season. Oh my gosh, one of my favorite episodes of the season. 